Hello and welcome back. Now, today we are particularly excited because we are presenting one of my favorite coffee machines, the Electra Micro Casa Semi Automatic. You can already get a picture of the coffee machine from the box itself and there's this handy plastic handle, it's very useful if you want to carry it on. Now, as soon as you open, you have this user, this brochure saying like all the other types of coffee machine that Electra sells, very nice. And then you have the user manual in English. And then of course here you have the declaration that this model is good and safe and yeah, it's a sort of quality control done by Electra for you. Now, it literally took us forever to take out this polystyrol box containing the coffee machine, but it was worth it because this coffee machine as a first impact is beautiful. It's nothing like any other coffee machines you will find in the market. Now, if you go inside the box, you will find this, which is the usual standard kit. You have the single and the double uh, basket, then you have the plastic tamper, but do you really want a plastic tamper in such a coffee machine? You may want to match your porta filter with this wood motor. I'm just saying, you know, if, if you want to do things well, you might be interested in a wooden tamper. Then, of course, you have the, the scoop too. Then, of course, you have this symbol of Electra and Eagle with the wide open wings, very nice, and of course you have to tie it up to this, which is the top of the tank, and as soon as you see this coffee machine you will notice that it's naked, naked in the sense that this is the actual tank and this is the actual boiler, so you don't have any protective, let's say, metal cage or anything, what you see is actually the coffee machine itself and its components are live. Okay, as you can see we have fitted our Electra Eagle on top and this is how we present you the coffee machine. It's entirely handcrafted and there's written also here. Now, it's very original and retro but it has the latest technology fitted inside still has a heat exchanger so you can do the coffee and the cappuccinos at the same time. You activate the cappuccino steam by turning this knob so it's very very simple to operate. Uh, and as I said before, uh, this is the coffee machine itself. You just pour in water from here so you don't have no plastic tank hidden inside the coffee machine. This is the actual tank. We're going to talk you through how it works and surprise surprise we're also going to do a coffee with it. So starting from down below here we have just turned it on and you turn it on by with this switch. Now you may wonder what's this switch which has some a drip of water. Now this is the water boiler switch and by pressing it you manually introduce the water from the tank, which is up here and which we have filled with water, inside the boiler, which is now working. And you may notice, well, this is the coffee switch, the brewing switch, and this here, this red light, stops to shine only when the coffee machine is ready. So, right now, it's still working. As you can see, this manometer here shows the pressure inside the boiler which is getting higher and higher and when it reaches the ideal pressure it will be ready. Okay now red light turned off so we can go. We get our double porta filter and you have our double dose. This 
shake it up a little bit so that and we can use our MacApp CPS. If you want to know more about this, link on the description. Oops. Okay. Now we're gonna use two cups, a normal coffee cup and a transparent one, just to show you the, how creamy the coffee actually becomes. And part of the merit is because of our great cherry A from Jamaica Cafe. So here are our two coffees, one is for our cameraman and this is mine, as you can see it's all nice and, and creamy, just at 30 millimeters, and it tastes amazing. Now the coffee was delicious and even the cameraman can confirm this, of course being uh, naked means also some drawbacks, which is that it's boiling hot so it's not all rainbows and sun but if you don't consider the impracticality of the super hot boiling edges it's a beautiful coffee machine and anyone can prove it and it's unique completely handcrafted with the charm of the past and the technology of the future as the, the slogan says so there it is, the charm of the past with the technology of the future. This machine is truly unique in everything and it's not like anything i ever seen before. Thank you so much for watching the video, hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe. We'll shortly come up with the other Electra, the Micro Casa Aleva and see you at the next video.